it's extremely important to keep um, improving the, patient, the care that we offer to patients. Because I work at the coalface, I can see where there are still areas that we don't have treatments for. Uh, I specialise particularly in retinal disorders and there is a condition called age-related macular degeneration which remains the leading cause of blindness in the Western world. For the wet form of the disease, we have had major developments over the last 10 years and we do now have a number of um, very exciting treatment options that can hugely improve outcomes and that's really come as a result of the basic science work that the National Eye Research Centre and under other funding bodies undertake. Dry macular degeneration is an area for which there are no current therapeutic avenues, but this is an area of active research based on laboratory studies that have translated into clinical practice. So we are shortly going to be starting a number of clinical trials for people with dry macular degeneration, which will potentially give them other treatment options. And there are um, studies going on in other units around the UK and around the world also looking at therapeutic avenues for dry macular generation. So since I became a consultant um, in 2001 there have been huge, huge developments in my field in terms of what we can offer patients. Um, considerable um, amounts of blindness have been prevented as a result of the research activity and we hope to continue that work um, significantly over the next few years. Mm -hmm.